Valley Sports Board here with Mike Schoonmaker and Devin Pierre after Marlboro's big 29-7 victory. Uh, Mike, let's start with you a little bit. Uh, the offense really got on track today. Tell me what was working. Oh, uh, from the start of the game, just offensive line receivers, coaches were on on point every single play. It's just it was a great time being here. What did you notice uh, on their defense? Like they they were a really hard hitting team. I give props to them. Everything we just happen to run the right plays at the right time. All right, Devin Pierre over 200 yards rushing today. What did you see against that defense? Sir, I seen a good defense today. They played their heart out. Even though they were down, they still got back up like it was first down again. Uh, now last week, coach told me that you guys are going back to basics. So does that mean a lot of on the ground football, a lot of rushing? We're gonna keep doing what we're doing in the game. Marlboro right. coach Rich Ward with us. Rich, congratulations on the big victory. Uh, yeah, two guys that uh, really rolled it up on offense. But let's put that aside for a moment. And talk about your defense basically pitched a shutout yeah the defense played well tonight we tackled much better uh, in the last two weeks our scheme was sound um, and uh, you know we went back to just you know getting getting off blocks and, and playing hard and, and doing the little things right and then uh, hopefully it's paying off you, you you told me a week ago after you beat uh, um, Antior, I think it was. Uh, round out. Round out, yeah. excuse me. You, you wanted to get back back to basics. What does it mean? Well, it means I thought we kind of did, we tried to do too much. And, um, you know, we were almost like a jack of all trades, a master of none. So we simplified a lot of the schemes that we did. And, uh, you know, it, it seemed to work. So hopefully we can keep building on what we have now. And, um, you know, we got a lot, of, we got all great opponents coming up. And uh, hopefully uh, we can make a little run. Uh, now let's talk a little bit about offense. Um, you, you were able to run wide. You were able to run uh, inside handoffs from the shotgun. You were able to run between the tackles. Talk a little bit about that O-line. Well, our O-line did a great job tonight. Uh, again, you know, th these kids ran, and we tell the offensive line it's the most unselfish thing you'll ever do in sports because you won't get any recognition. And, um, you know, they did a great job tonight, and it was a total team effort. You know, so uh, our linemen and, and our total program and staff need to be um, thanked for a great effort for the week. All right, how about Devin and uh, Michael? Uh, you're looking at almost 400 yards rushing there between them. Yeah, you know, they're two good weapons that we have, and uh, hopefully we're getting another weapon back next week and uh, with Cornelius, and, uh, you know, it's another weapon that we can use in our arsenal. Um, pretty happy where, where, where our kids are. You know, Highland's a great team. Uh, they come to play. Those kids come to play with a lot of emotion and energy. And, uh, you know, I was proud of how our kids played out in the second half because, you know, they, you know, coach a mistake on my part, you know, in the second half or in the first, second quarter there. And, uh, you know, I told them, I said, I'll try to be better if you are. And uh, I was proud of how they came out. All right. Congratulations, Coach. Thanks.